What's up everybody? Welcome back to the Pokemon Slayer YouTube channel. How's the Slayer Squad been? And today, welcome back to Deck Tech Saturday. And today I'm going to be testing out that Rayquaza deck y'all saw me profile. Uh <laughs> probably four days ago. I don't know how many days. Don't 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 listen to me, but yes, I'm going to be testing it out here and let's get straight into this. I'll be right back once I'm done shuffling. All right, and we're back. Let's get this started. All right, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So basically, I'm going to be showing y'all how fast the deck can actually get set up. And since we're by ourselves, it's a shaman. And then three, six. So the idea of a Mega Rayquaza deck is that you want it to be set up by first turn. Let's take a look at our hand. Oh, it looks nice. All right, so we shake our opponent's hand, and I'll draw a card, shaman. Her, what am I gonna do? I got an Ultra Ball. I'll play Ultra Ball away, Guzma, and what should I do? Because I could get a lot more stuff set up. I have all the right stuff in my hand. Guess Battle Compressor. Search my deck for. Come on, be in here, be in here, be in here. There we are. I'll get out on Hoopa and activate its ability. So get out Shaman. Wait, do I even need a Shaman? Yeah, I'll just grab it. Shaman. No, actually, no. Even better. Mega Rayquaza. Like, I'm gonna show y'all if this deck is set up. Uh, Quaza and I guess a Keldeo. Alright, so I'm gonna show y'all if that this deck can definitely set up if it goes second turn or first turn. Because thanks to Mega Rayquaza's like ancient trait ability to where it could Q evolution to where it could evolve immediately. Especially since we already have that spirit link in our hand. Might as well get it out. Alright, stick this in our hand. Bench Keldeo, bench to Rayquaza. Attach Spirit Link, Mega Evolve, Attach, Attach Floatstone to the Keldeo, Ben Shaman, for a full hand of six, amazingness, one, two, three, four, five, six, put that back on top of there, alright, let's see what we got, mmm, dang, the Battle Compressor would have been very nice to use, should I risk it for the Biscuit, mmm, more risky for the biscuit then shaman for one more it's an ultra ball dang it that probably was not a smart move most people would have waited if i was at a tournament or something oh wait what oh redo guys i forgot this was a tapu lele whoops guys redo my apologies for that if i i forgot that was a tapu lele i would have tapu lele Yes, guys, misplays happen. I would have tapu lele for not a chorus. Possibly Chittaper. No, not a Juniper. Come on. Oh, if I have to, I will chorus. Yep, looks like I'm going to be chorus. So, chorus for five. Cha -da -do -do. Do, 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 do. How's this? man? Oh man. But yeah. I forgot I had a Tapu Lele in my hand. I forgot Tapu Lele was even in this deck. So one, two, three, four, five. It's kind of bad to forget that you have certain cards in your deck. I think I might hold my hand as it is for now. Because I got a computer search, super rod, and it's like actually. But if I was to go second, here I'm going to show y'all, I'm going to pretend like I'm going second turn. If I was going second turn, I would totally be like, Ugh, computer search away. Uh, Jennifer and Battle Compressor. To search my deck for, let's see, what can I get out of this? It's like, I would totally do that. Make it super sneaky and grab this. Oh wait, no, whoops. <laughs> I thought it was this. I'll grab this right here. And shuffle. And yeah. 
All right, and then I would say pass, pass. So draw a card, it's DCE. Play sky field. And do I have anything in my discard pile? No, I do not. So I guess I will just touch. Nah. All right, I will. What? Ah, I guess I will. It's a use it or lose it situation right now. And via seeker for Juniper. Discarding my hand basically. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Alrighty. Oh, huh, wow. That wasn't even really much needed. Bench that. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, it's not worth it doing that at the moment. So, I will, of course, rush and retreat into my Mega Ray. And I'll basically be able to use Emerald Break by my second turn. You're guaranteed to be able to use Emerald Break by your second turn. And yeah, guys, that was just a small demonstration as it is. And my apologies for the misplay. Even if I did that misplay, I still would have been able to set up. Because this deck has been, like, it guarantees me first turn, second turn setups. This is a, it's like 99.99999998% of the time sets up by first turn and second turn. So that's the reason why a lot of my friends don't like playing against me whenever I have a Mega Rayquaza built. And Mega Rayquaza is just really broken as it is still. But yeah, guys, this is Deck Tech Saturday, and this is Pokemon Slayer signing off. Later.